What up, fam? It's your boy, G. Rich. I'm back here. I'm getting ready to go outside today, y'all. I'm about to hit that grill. Yes, sir. Today, I'm going to specialize in the Sweet Baby Ray's Honey Barbecue Ribs. Yes, sir. I'm going to cook them a little. I'm going to cook them the same way I usually cook them. But then at the end, I'm going to do it different with the sauce, okay? I'm going to show you about what's going down in just a little bit. Matter, matter of fact, I'm going to make you wait to the end. But anyway, I'm going to start out with these 40 wings. Remember the 40 wings I was telling you about? The 100 wings I seasoned and everything? Well, I got 40 of them here. I got 40 of them left. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a little something to it and then put them on the grill first. So I'm going to grill those first. They're still good. They still smell so good, y'all. The onions and stuff, see there? Now, I don't even have to cut the onions up on it. Yes, yeah, sir. It's going down today, NFL Sunday. Hold on tight. I'll be right back. Okay, so now I got the 40 wings here. Look at that. You can see the onions and stuff up in there. Look at that. Huh? Look at that. Huh? Yes, sir. Okay, so all you can do, you can you can always, when you save your food and stuff, and you want to cook it later, try to revamp something with it. So what I'm going to revamp it with is, yes, yeah, sir, French's yellow mustard. It's going down. And for 40 wings, I'm going to use one full cup of French's yellow mustard. That's all I'm going to do to it so it can be juicy when it come off that grill. With that flavor, I'm going to go ahead and mix it up and get a little dirty. Great day in the morning, man. That thing smell good, man. Yes, yeah, sir. Don't fall out of there now, boy. See, that's why I like those big old bowls. I can get all the way in there. Be teasing me. Big things come in small packages, huh? Believe. It. Okay, so. Uh, yes, yeah, sir. Look at you hear that? Oh, man. There it goes. It's getting that color now. Mix it in with that seasoning. Yep, keep flipping it. Voila. Now we're going to head on to the ribs. And then we'll head outside. All right, fam. So here we go. I'm going to clean my ribs off. I got two slabs of the spare ribs and three slabs of the baby bags, okay? Yes, yeah, sir. Then this is all you're going to need for this particular thing. For this particular uh, uh, batch here, yes, now, yeah, I'm going to have to be a little slick with this one here. But anyway, this is my um, in-your-mouth season right here. All-purpose in-your-mouth season. And it's like 11 different herbs and spices in it. But I'll give you the main one so you might want to try this recipe. Okay, um, ground mustard. Um, of course, you got a little salt, garlic, pepper onion powder, I mean garlic powder, onion powder, and cayenne pepper. Or you can use complete seasoning and cayenne pepper. Either way you want to use that until I can get this patented and um, yeah, get this manufactured now. <laughs> I can't tell you what's all in it. So anyway, we're going to use a cup and a half of G Rich In Your Mouth seasoning. Cup and a half. Down up in there. Why? That's all you need. Cause I'm really gonna um specialize in the um uh, the honey barbecue sauce. Okay. Put that over there. It's dirty time. Rub it in there good. Yeah. Get it on in there. Yeah, flip it. Through. Rub it in there. Be scared. It's all on the side. That's why I put it on the side for a reason. So I keep flipping it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. You can smell the garlic. Mm -hmm. I tell y'all, man, there's some good stuff in that seasoning. They got to go through the proper channels to get that done, okay? But you should be fine with what I gave you. You know, you put on there. According, you know, like I said, if you got five slabs, I use a cup and a half. You can just use what um, the seasoning I gave you. It still come out good. 
just can't give you every every one yet just yet okay Ooh, you see I got them braised in there I like seasoning this way I'm afraid to get in there and get a little dirty but the food will come out so good yeah look at that man see what I'm saying look at that mama there goes that man now we're getting ready to head outside to the grill I told you I'm going to do the wings first and then the ribs last because I'm going to end the ribs a little different than I normally do yes sir heading outside all right, fam, as you can see right now, the grill is ready to go. Mm -hmm. yeah, this, this already cleaned off. Good, good, good. Look at that, huh? Yes, sir. All right. Here they go. Yeah, I should be able to fit all 40 of these wings on here so I'm gonna make use of my space best believe it you gotta know how you no matter how small your grill is you gotta know how to work it to fit your needs best believe it yes yeah, sir all right Mm-hmm. They ain't already cooking good. Now after these get done, I'm gonna scrape and clean that grill off, and then I'm gonna add the ribs. I might cut the ribs in half, y'all. Be able to get all five slabs on at one time. And I can put some in there also, if I need the space. I'm gonna make it work for me. I don't know about you. Make do with what you got. So you can get better, ain't that right? Mm -hmm. Now look at all them onions at the bottom. Now all they ain't going to waste. Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. Close this one here. Close this here. Bam. I'm going to go ahead and keep them bits closed up because it's going to be, you know, it's already hot enough, so it should do it. Now, I'll be back. What we're going to do, I'm going to just let this go ahead and cook. Because I'm almost specialized with the ribs being done, okay? So, hold on tight. I'll be right back with the finished look on these chicken wings. And then, we're going to move to the ribs. Alright, fam. If they, I think they should be done. Let's check them and see if they're ready to go. They should be. Yeah, that's a thing of beauty. Look at that. Uh-huh. Look at that. You can see the juiciness in the meat. Mm, mm, mm. So I'm going to go ahead and take these off, clean this grill back off, and get ready for my ribs, okay? I already had cut one, one slab of rib, fam, and I put it over here. Uh, I ain't playing with y'all, man. I ain't playing with you. Ooh, wee, that looks good. All right, so hold on. I'll be back. Get ready for the ribs, okay? Okay, fam. Finalize this here. And the rest of the residue up for there. As you can see, that that, that uh, grill is still hot, like I told you. See. Mm-hmm. Ooh 
Man, I ain't playing with y'all, man. Yes, sir. The thing of beauty. Look, bam. <laughs> Make use of your space. Some people say, man, you need a bigger grill. Maybe one day. But until then, I'm going to use what I got. Got to make it work for me. Bam. That's why I slab the ribs on this little grill. Y'all better come on, man. Yes, sir. Hold on tight. I'll be right back. All right. All right, fam. I got them off all, all, I got all of them off the grill. And, um... I'm getting ready to put the ribs on now. I just want to give y'all a little finished look of the wings. All right, fam. Let's check them and get ready to turn them over. I got the vents closed, too. Because y'all know how I like my ribs. I like them good and tender. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Yes, sir. Yeah. Mm, 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 mm. Just getting started. Okay, fam. Yes, sir. It's getting pretty close. But I'm a, I want to tell you, since it's getting pretty close to the end, this is what's, what's going to happen. Okay. When these ribs are about 90 to 95% done, I'm going to take them off. I'm going to cut them up. I'm going to put uh, probably a slab, probably between about two slabs of rib, probably one spare rib and one uh, uh, baby back. I'm going to cut them up and put them into a little bowl, sauce bowl. I'm going to drench them. Yes, sir. I'm going to drench them. With uh, sweet baby rays, honey barbecue sauce. I'm gonna I'm gonna mix it up, and I'm gonna put them back on the grill. And that's the specialty of today. Yes, sir. It's going down. I advise you to try that. Okay, fam. Let's check them. Uh huh. You see, you see the juiciness in the meat. That's how you want your rib. Mm-hmm. Still got about 20 more minutes to go, fam. Cook them down a little bit more. Then I'm going to cut them, cut them up and bring some back. Yes, yeah, sir. Look at that. Okay, fam. You ready to take some off? Look at that. <laughs> okay. I'm going to take one spare rib off. And I'm going to take one baby back. And I'm going to show you what I'm going to do with the sweet baby rays. And I'm going to take these off. And these, I'm not going to put any sauce on these. Look at that. I'm not going to put any sauce on them because my family stack these up now. Because my family don't want any sauce. Look at that. I'll see you inside. Okay, fam. I'm getting ready to cut these up. And we'll sit them in this bowl. I'm going to drench them with the uh, Sweet Baby Ray's Honey Barbecue Sauce. I'm going to, you know, get them all gooey and sticky and looking pretty. And I'm going to put them back on the grill. Okay, and I'm gonna put them on there for between five to ten minutes, and let so it can get so it can, you know, cook on there and get a little sticky icky. Yeah, sir, it's gonna be it's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. Oh man, come on, man, look at that, cutting like butter. They moist. Oh y'all, man, I ain't playing with y'all, man. Mmm. Mm. 
Man, you know what? I been knew how to how to cook, but my baby taught me, and my baby Teresa done taught me a whole lot of other stuff, and it done put sent me on another level. I ain't up with the Joneses yet though, but I'm getting there. The Joneses meaning the people who really been, I mean, cooking and creating their stuff, and I mean, shots out to them, man. People like uh, in the kitchen with Gina and. Uh, cooking and grilling, uh, 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 smoking and grilling with my boy AB. That's my man now. Last but not least, my boy Ray. Ray Mack. You already know how I feel about you, bro. It's all good. Man, I tell you, man. I'm learning. If I miss somebody else, it's a, uh, it's a few more people like uh, Smoking Joe. That's my boy. Yes, sir. It's coming. Big Poppy. Yes, sir. So, matter of fact, since this bowl is so small, I think I got another bowl that can go. Hold on, we might be able to make it, y'all. We might be able to make it. I mean, it's cutting like butter. See? They're going to go back on the grill and finish. Finish just getting so get, finish getting extra pretty for y'all. Yes, I said pretty. Yes, I did. Mm, 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 mm. Okay. Go take these gloves off. Be right back. Okay, so there it is. It's going in. Mm. Yep, I'm gonna use this whole bottle. Okay. There's a method to my madness. I stole that from my wife. Don't y'all don't tell me. I just grind that up in there. Get it all at the bottom. Man, don't be scared. Y'all got to stop being scared to get dirty now. I told y'all before, if it ain't rough, it ain't right. Sloppy, in effect, but effective. Okay. Keep rotating until all of them covered real good. Come this way, yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm moving them around. Okay. We back out here. Look at that, huh? You see how I stacked them up there? Yes, sir. Now, I'm not going to put no sauce on them like I told you. Because they want some with the sauce and some without. This is my specialty right here. If you like this recipe, it's going to be in the description area. You just stack them up here. It don't matter. They'll get done. Because all you're doing is finalizing it. So it can get good and sticky and it can soak on to that. We got two different types of ribs. Smoked ribs and chicken. Then you got some honey barbecue ribs in your mouth. Ooh, ooh, y'all see it? I told you they're good and gooey. I'm trying to waste none of that. See what they're gonna do? They're gonna they're gonna smoke the, the it's gonna smoke onto the ribs, and it's gonna get real sticky. No gloves. Yes, sir. I'm getting ready to take these off, cut them up, and pan them up, and wrap it up. Right back. 
Okay, Duke. All right, fam. The check and see. It should have been no caramelized on here. There it is. Yeah. You see that? You saw it's caramelized on there. That's what I was looking for. You, you look at that. You see what I'm saying? Y'all yeah, gonna catch on a little bit. So in five minutes, I'm gonna take them off. Y'all yeah, gonna catch on. Mm, 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 mm. Right off the grill, fam. These are my honey barbecue. I'm, I, I might as well say my sweet baby Ray's honey barbecue ribs. They're delicious, fam. You should try it. I'll be back with the finished look. All right, fam. This is the finished look. My specialty, sweet baby Ray's, one of my specialties, honey barbecue ribs. They're delicious. I advise you to take me up on it. There's my uh, smoked ribs. Yes, sir. You know the season I put on it. Yes, sir. <laughs> G Rich in your mouth season. Don't forget it. It's, a, it's, it's, it's time consuming and it, it takes a while to get it organized. I got to find, you know, the way to get it organized and patent and all that stuff and, and make sure no one else has the exact same season as I have. So it's going to take a minute, but just hold on tight. Anyway, and here's the wings. Hey, man, you like what I do. I appreciate y'all, man. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for the love and the blessing. And back at you. Love y'all to life. G-Rich out in your mind.